Amputation is the removal of part or all of a body part that is enclosed by skin. There are 2.1 million people living with limb loss in the USA, and that number is expected to double by 2050. Causes Diseases, such as blood vessel disease, called peripheral vascular disease or PVD, diabetes, blood clots, or osteomyelitis, an infection in the bones, are from the reasons that cause amputation. Injuries, especially of the arms. 75% of upper extremity amputations are related to trauma. Surgery to remove tumors from bones and muscles. Amputation procedures. An amputation usually requires a hospital stay of 5 to 14 days or more depending on the surgery and complications. The procedure itself may vary, depending on the limb or extremity being amputated and the patient's general health. Amputation may be done under general anesthesia, meaning the patient is asleep, or with spinal anesthesia, which numbs the body from the waist down. When performing an amputation, the surgeon removes all damaged tissue while leaving as much healthy tissue as possible. A doctor may use several methods to determine where to cut and how much tissue to remove. These include Checking for a pulse close to where the surgeon is planning to cut. Comparing skin temperatures of the affected limb with those of a healthy limb. Looking for areas of reddened skin. Checking to see if the skin near the site where the surgeon is planning to cut is still sensitive to touch. During the procedure itself, the surgeon will remove the diseased tissue and any crushed bone smooth uneven areas of bone. Seal off blood vessels and nerves. Cut and shape muscles so that the stump, or end of the limb, will be able to have an artificial limb prosthesis, attached to it. Loss of a limb produces a permanent disability that can impact a patient's self-image, self-care, and mobility. Rehabilitation of the patient with an amputation begins after surgery during the acute treatment phase. As the patient's condition improves, a more extensive rehabilitation program is often begun. The success of rehabilitation depends on many variables, including the following, level and type of amputation, type and degree of any resulting impairments and disabilities, overall health of the patient, family support. In order to help reach these goals amputation rehabilitation program may include the following. Treatments to help improve wound healing and stump care. Activities to help improve motor skills, restore activities of daily living, ADLS, and help the patient reach maximum independence. Exercises that promote muscle strength, endurance, and control. Fitting and use of artificial limbs, prostheses. Pain management for both postoperative and phantom pain sensation of pain that occurs below the level of the amputation. Emotional support to help during the grieving period and with readjustment to a new body image. Use of assistive devices. Nutritional counseling to promote healing and health. Vocational counseling. Adapting the home environment for ease of function, safety, accessibility, and mobility. Patient and family education. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.